Hi, my name is Stuart with Metro Home Theater Group. Today we're going to discuss features and functions of Spyclops products. So to set the DVR up for cloud-based access, if you've already got it connected to your network but it shows offline, there's a quick and easy step that we'll need to do. Uh, first, to make sure that it is connected to the network, we're going to right-click and we're going to select System Setup. Then we'll select Network Setup. And then we'll see if there's a, a nine-digit number showing. Currently, there's not a nine-digit number and it shows offline. What we'll need to do to speed this process up because the DVR uses a UPnP to gain access to the, for remote viewing, we're going to need to reboot this DVR. And to do that, we're going to just select OK here in Network Setup. We're going to right click. We're going to select Exit System. And then we're going to select Reboot. When it asks you if you're sure you want to reboot, you want to tell it yes. And then the DVR will reboot. Now that your DVR is reboot, sometimes it can take a couple minutes, uh, but in this case, we're now switched to, and we see it now it's switched from offline to online, and that means this unit is now ready for remote viewing. You'll want to take note of the nine digit number in the bottom right hand corner of your screen. This is your cloud ID. For more information and helpful videos, please visit us at metrahometheater.com.